Flu season is coming. The experts say this is going to be a bad one too, but some new potent flu shots might help. Hi everybody, glad you're with us tonight. I'm Darren Kramer. I'm Ann Nyberg. You might already be hearing sniffles and sneezes from coworkers and friends. That's because the flu is already here in Connecticut. Yeah, we just said that. It's hmm. already here. Even though temperatures are in the 80s, it could be a very nasty flu season. Yeah, we got your back tonight. News Ace Bob Wilson talked to some experts about how to stay ahead of the flu. He is live in Hartford with more. Bob? Hard to believe it. We're out here in the short sleeves. It's a beautiful night. Last thing you're thinking is flu, cold, miserable, coughing, sneezing, that kind of thing. But you know what? They've already had flu cases here in Connecticut, here in Hartford Hospital, and the Hospital of Central Connecticut. Other hospitals are stocking up the flu vaccine. It's starting to come in, and they're preparing early. So far, there's been some local spread of influenza. The flu already in Connecticut and hitting early this year. The Center for Disease Control in Atlanta warns of a harsh flu season with vaccines arriving this week in area hospitals. It's difficult to predict. It could stay like this for weeks to months or we could have an early flu season. It's very difficult to predict what the influenza virus is going to do. So there are a lot of advances this year in the flu vaccine, a lot of new ways to distribute it. There are also new strains put into it how it's mixed and manufactured, and they also have different doses and different strains depending on your vulnerability. So they say you should check with your health care provider to see which flu vaccine is right for you. The very young and old, as well as the immunosuppressed, are the hardest hit by the flu. Doctors say you should get vaccinated. Wash your hands, they emphasize that one. Stay home when you are sick and cover your nose and mouth when you sneeze. That's because the flu is transmitted through the air. Doctors recommend limiting handshakes and touching your face. There's a high dose vaccine for the elderly patients. There are some vaccines that have four types of influenza in them rather than three types of influenza in them. There are egg free vaccines. Those who are allergic to eggs can get that. They say you want to get out on top of it. They have the nasal mist, which has been around for a while from ages two to 49. You can take that. You have to be healthy, not have any respiratory problems in order to take that one. You just got to get out ahead of it, stay on top of it, and get the flu shot they recommend. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live in Hartford, News 8.